as this. I'm sorry. Sack of wine, and we got Destiny as well. What's your Twitter handle, my man? It is at Dr. Underscore Dunks. That's easy. Destiny and Sack of wine. Sack of wine staying in the hot seat, and he's looking for more blood. Yes. There you are, I found you. Yeah, I've got, I think, about eight followers or six followers or something like that. I just set this kind of count up like two days ago. Um, yeah, I've never been much of a Twitter guy, but I'm trying to get into it. And I definitely see the appeal, honestly. But like, um, sometimes it feels like we got a bit of a social media overload in our lives. But, uh, you know, uh, being in like a gaming community, it's definitely an important aspect of it. And that's why I picked it up. So... We've got Sack of Wine versus Destiny. Sack of Wine being the Peach player uh, in Port 1 versus Destiny, who is the Falco uh, you see on the right side here. And so far, very even matchup. They're both uh, just trying to feel each other out right now. Oh, great turn up by Bag of Wine. Ooh, but, uh, yeah. I thought he was going to tech that or yeah. something. That was, uh, that, that was a little bit of a misplay, but that, that's not easy to get. You know, you need to know it's coming to be ready for that. A lot of people aren't just like spamming or all to deal with that. He evens it up without taking a single percent, though. Very good stuff. Man, Destiny is doing a great job so far, just keeping on the pressure. Not letting the Peach really uh, pull out any turnips and do some janky neutral air stuff. Peach, Peaches like to approach with the neutral airs and the down airs and then float cancel that instantly into like a down smash. Oh, good reflector by Destiny to knock that turnip back. Using the reflector for what it was made for? Who does I that? I know, that's oh. a little bit unorthodox, eh? But uh, I like it. Um, especially, like, if, if they don't predict it and it does hit them, the fact that you get hit stunned by the, the shield, the reflector, yeah, doesn't really that. matter, you know? Oh, I, I hate that. I think that you should be able that. to jump out of it still, you yeah, know? Yeah, me too. You should be able to jump out of it, but, like, that would create a whole new dimension to spaces that I don't really know if I'm ready for. Yeah. Um, <laughs> if you like, can reflect you, projectiles can, and can jump you, cancel yeah, it. Can you imagine Samus versus versus Spaces? That would be, it that would would be, be nightmare. devastating. Yeah. Yeah. Or like Link versus Spaces too. It would yeah. just be like, it, it would be awful. Because so, I know a lot of the times I do try and reflect like the smash missiles and things like yeah. that. And they're not expecting it at a high percent. Maybe exactly. get a quick kill. But like, can you imagine? If oh, you, oh, that's unfortunate by Destiny. Destiny. Hopefully you can bring it down back air. here because it's, this is a really even matchup. It looked like he was trying to get like a full hop or short hop down there. Oh, these Shizwiz combos. Yeah, the jump just did not come out and he ended up falling to his death, poor guy. Ooh! Drops the booty on him, doesn't convert into a dishwasher combo, and that forward smash is not going to do it. Good DI by Sack of Wine. Back air, soft back air. Yeah, Destiny is on him. Oh, catches him with the forward crushes smash. Crushes him. Ooh, dash attack to grab. Oh, to re-grab. Doesn't get a third, though. Back throw. Very weird choice of throws by uh, Sack of Wine here. Definitely could have done another down throw or up throw and capitalized into a combo. Oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> See, now that is the part where you're going to get punished. Yeah, you got stuck in the lag and yeah. then got neutral aired because of it. And that just showing a little bit of an experience with, honestly, the character. Yeah. Um, and, like, uh, uh, Destiny's playing uh, relatively well. But it's really important that you understand that you've stunned yourself when you actually reflect a projectile yeah, you with just, your reflector. Yeah, you can't be doing that. You can't be just jumping jumping out and doing that. Yeah, that's a little day. bit willy-nilly, and uh, I don't think that's going to work too well for him. So he, he's got to really reevaluate how he wants to deal with Peach's turn-ups in this matchup. Ooh, rolls right into another up throw. Uh, he, he needs to be careful not just jumping on top of the Peach like that. Um, Falco, like a lot of them obviously love to use his down air because it's very strong, uh, but just doing like a full double full hop down air on top of someone is like not a very good approach, it's honestly. It's very telegraphed. Yeah, it's, very, it's very obvious, obvious that they want to do that. And he has no jumps. Oh, and he's just able to recover. Oh, I thought he was going to go for a down air and then try and get a read forward smash off, but goes for the back air instead. Oh, good wow. Stuff. Destiny is finally getting a, side, getting a lead out Jab, this jab, forward smash. I think what Destiny needs to do is a lot more um, cross-up aerials because he's doing a lot of like back airs and, and yeah. neutral airs and, and down airs right, right on the in front shield. Of her. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, if, for sure. if he kind of leaps over the shield and gets a back air out, he, he can't get shield grabbed, of course. He can still get down smash. Good grab. 
But um, no, yeah. Destiny is showing some some like some good uh, like really weirdly specific tech skills, like <laughs> grabbing the turnips yeah. like, really well, and uh, but then like not really having a whole lot of shine pressure, you know, and like jumping out of the shine somewhat late. Just, yeah. Like, kind of see like you see what I mean there. Like that's like a really obvious place where you need to like be ready for your follow up, um, and that's like. 90% of what makes Falco good is his ability to follow up on himself, you know? Uh, that was a little bit of an unfortunate choice for recovery there, but that, he didn't get punished too hard, comes back up with the up B. Yeah, lucky for him he was able to trade with that up B. Oh, I knew oh, that turnip was going to hit from like three moves away too. Good choice on the up B. Back throw to keep him off. Oh, it doesn't go high enough. Destiny doing a much better job this time though. He can easily uh, take this stock off Sakawine with like a quick forward smash. And that's gonna be oh. it. Dash attack up Shouts there. Shouts out to Arcadian Frog. <laughs> I like that name. I feel like the hype, unless that's actually Frog who made that account, the hype train is just too yeah. real for Frog right now. Arcadian Frog, that's Arcadian amazing. Arcadian Frog, shouts out. Arcadian Frog, his favorite character is Frog, he says. My favorite character is Frog. I think I think uh, uh, they're gonna put an official frog character in Smash Four now too. Slippy? Yeah, <laughs> Slippy. Can you imagine? Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and put the worst Star Fox character. Yeah, that no one the wants most to annoying have. Star Fox yeah. character. Ooh, it's tries to read him with a forward smash. Very good attempt by Sakawan, knowing that Destiny would roll back uh, backwards if he tossed him towards the ledge. A lot of characters will do that because they don't want to be on that ledge. No. So they'll either roll towards you or kind of like no, spot that's, dodge there. That's a really good tech trap. Yeah. Um, to, to like force somebody into the outside position there and then really test if they have the courage to like roll towards the edge. Yeah. I know a lot of the time people are waiting for you to roll backwards towards them because you don't want to be on that ledge, yep. so I'll just stay there. And then they'll try and forward smash me or something and completely miss. So in the minds of the person who's setting up the tech trap, there's only one option they're going to do, and that's roll away from the edge. Yeah. So you know it's coming. Exactly. I wish Bob was freed for this tourney. You know, um, I, in my opinion, not letting him be here is kind of freeing him. Bob like, who? Bo like Bob the Marth player who just got added to PR. He's a Marth player. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what his name is. He, he's really good. Like, Bob Money? Bob Money, yeah. <laughs> Bob Money is someone else, but I bet Bob is definitely Money. His Marth sounds like Money. Yes. Forward throw. Oh, it doesn't get the edge guard back throw, though. Now, Destiny recovering really high as opposed to going for the ledge. Oh, thinking goes that maybe for that cheeky down air. That's, that's not going to work out. Oh, if he was Fox, he could have easily grabbed.